Luke, Luke, Luke. I am your father. You are my father. Yes, 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 yes. I am your father. Here at the lake, it's time for MTV Slam for November. Let's do this. My conditions today are, it's, it's sunny, there are no clouds, barely any clouds in the sky. Water temperature is about, water temperature is around 58 degrees. So I'm thinking the bass is going to be up shallow because once it gets into the, the lower, once it gets in the mid 40s, I think that's when they start going deep for the winter. So about 58, so should should be up shallow. But we just had a cold front come through, so I don't know if that's going to affect them that bad. Because this morning it was 30 degrees, it was cold. So I'm trying to fish nice and slow. First thing I'm going to start with is the shaky shad on a little road runner spin, so under spin. Uh, see if we can catch something like this. Got a fish, all right. Man, you choke this thing, good gosh. Man, look how hook good he is hooked right there. So I caught this little guy on that gambler. Oh, he tore that head up. I caught him on the, uh, the that gambler shaky shad and I put it on a road runner. Works great for cold water. Look at that fish pretty fish. All right, buddy, time to go. Enjoy. Yes. Bait number one out the way. Glad I came back here. Put one of these tail slappers on this Casey's Classic Runner. All right, so I caught that fish in about five to six feet of water. So I'm gonna run back up here to where it's about six foot deep. Does this count for a fish? <laughs> uh, some type of weed lily pad or something? <laughs> Guess not. All right, well, I'm gonna go try deeper water because that one fish is the only one I caught. So I guess let's try something different.
This is the best way to get under a bridge. Didn't complete the MTV slam for November fully. Caught one fish on the Gambler Shaky Shad. And what I did with the bait was put it on a Roadrunner head and ran it just like that. We just had a cold front come through where I live and it was 30 degrees this morning. So I felt that bite was more finesse than anything. Um, some of the baits that came in were a little bit more power baits. So I think that's why they didn't react well to it. But I, you know, tried to cut the tail slapper in a certain way and put it on a swim hook and then also on a road runner I couldn't get it to run straight so but on the frog I had a couple blow ups but they didn't commit to it so what can you do that's why it's called fish some days the fish want to cooperate other days they don't oh well well thank you for watching this video please subscribe to my youtube channel because there's going to be a lot more fishing videos to come as always See you bassoon. <laughs> and I'm still not gonna lick this. It smells awful. Oh gosh, it's awful. It smells like garlic. Here, smell that.